Hi, I'm Bruce Wallace from the um, Beetle Buster uh, Baseboard. I'm going to give a uh, bit of a rundown on how this baseboard actually works. Um, I'm the designer and the manufacturer of these. Keeps me very busy these days, I can tell you. Um, it has a lot of uh, design features in it um, that is far different to any other bottom baseboard to control the actual high beetle. Um, probably the first biggest um, thing to notice is the corrugated floor on the bottom of the baseboard, which is below, cuts down below where the frames are sitting up, just above on the high part. The, um, all the bottom part of the corrugation area has got a series of holes where only the beetle will sit down and not feed. So that's very important. The, uh, the other very important design feature of this baseboard, don't know whether you can see them, is these angles. So that when the beetle enters the hive where the bees come in, they walk along the rib, they're badgered by the bees, and they end up down in the low section of the baseboard. From there, they can't possibly get up past this angle. And on the other end, same deal, there's another angle there. So at the moment, they're stuck on the bottom, they're getting harassed by the bees. And now, what do they do? Well, they can't go up into the brood box because they can't get past the angle. They can't climb the corrugation because it's too slippery. So they end up getting driven down through the holes, which is onto the under tray, the inspection tray, which um, has a guide to make sure a light sprinkle, and um, what that does is basically kill the beetle within no time. Uh, this is a, a photo of uh, early design, way, way, way back, but this is pretty well exactly the same as today. You can see the row of uh, brood cappings there. The bees just, did, um, just put all their waste down through the holes. Ends up on the baseboard, saves them a lot of work. Because in a normal conventional baseboard, they have to put it out through the front entrance. You'll notice there that the, in this particular shot there, I can't, probably can't see it from there, but there's a lot of beetle on that. And that was probably in our um, early summer and uh, getting great results. The, um, there are other photos, a bit of close up. A lot of beetle in that one. That's just a close up shot so you can see it. And um, another one there. So this thing, it works. I've seen a lot of other types of uh, baseballs. Yep, okay, well, this one works. There's no possible way it can't work because once the beetle are in, they can't get out. They can't even climb up this corrugate. So there you have it. That's the Beetle Buster baseboard. And um, it's going in leaps and bounds. So um, we're onto a good thing here. It's really controlling the hive beetle and um, keeping out from climbing our hive. And that's what it's all about. So I um, hope it's been uh, an informative uh, part of how it works. Um, I know it's pretty brief, but it's basically in a nutshell, that's how it works. So, uh, thanks for your time, and if you've got any problems to, or you want to know about this baseboard, you can visit our website or Facebook page. So,